Could Adele have done better in her lyric with someone like you? First of all, let's just establish that Adele is a goddess. She's gorgeous. She can sing. She is fantastic. She could probably buy and sell me about a hundred times. She's doing all right. Okay. But that being said, even the most prolifically talented, amazing people, not every single component of every single piece of thing that they do is perfect. And someone like you is like an amazing song. I mean, the world has been united by crying over ice cream to that song. However, as someone who's been teaching songwriting for 25 plus years, let me just say there is one section of this song that I feel like is kind of a letdown. And if you're like me, you have the feely, feely, feely feels all the way through the first chorus. But then when you hit verse two, you check out just a little bit. Verse one has us in kind of a time space. She's got her five second scene, right? She's got a time space context. She's showing up uninvited. That's established in the pre-chorus. But she's heard that he's found a girl. He's married now, blah, blah, blah. And then he's acting shy. So we have this sense that they're face to face somewhere and he was not expecting to see her. She's clearly still carrying a torch for him. We all feel the ache of that, right? But then we get to verse two. You know how time flies. Only yesterday was a time of our lives. We were born and raised in a summer haze, bound by the surprise of these glory days. It's kind of like waxing philosophical and, and, and going backward, but it's taken us out of the time space of where we were in verse one. They were face to face. Now, it didn't establish that he was currently with the girl, like in that scene. But what if he was? What if instead of verse two, it was waxing nostalgia? What if she either, number one, said something to the girl that he's found? Or what if she said something about the babies that she had named that they're never going to have or the future that she had dreamed of that they're never going to have? And then she goes back to, never mind, I'll find someone like you. I feel like that for me personally would keep me more engaged. Now the bridge is again, and not, nothing compares, you know, regrets and mistakes and that's all that. That to me doesn't feel quite so much like a letdown because I'm not expecting to still be in that scene. But that is my suggestion of how this amazing hit song could possibly be better. So I know it's kind of like, who does she think she is, right? But it's just my thoughts.